Welcome back to Just the Facts, where we talk about just facts, only facts, and no opinions, just facts. My name is Chloe, and I'm here today with my friends Alex. Hey, yo. And Hunter. Hello. All right, we have a very, very, very special episode for you guys today. Do we? Because the topic is dogs. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Dogs are literally the last the best. time we had a dog fact. No, we're not talking about so. that. We're not talking about that. <laughs> we're no, we're doing actual ballistic. wholesome <laughs> dog facts today, everybody. <laughs> because don't you just love dogs? I love dogs. I like dogs too. Dogs are pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm personally a cat fan. No, dogs we're not. are cool too. Okay, so Hunter, we're not gonna talk to Alex <laughs> because of his. Words. Welcome back to Just the Facts with Chloe and Hunter. Chloe and Hunter. Wait, 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 what do you mean? No, I it's okay. It's okay. As long as you still you like dogs. Yes, dogs. I like both. Okay. End I it there. Hunter, what's your fact? <laughs> you sound like you had a butt there. I don't know. I know no, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. No butts. No opinions, no butts. Okay. Hunter, fact. <laughs> so we all know that a dog's sense of smell is incredibly... It's incredible how much better their sniffers are than ours. I was going to say sniffers. Yes. That's so funny. <laughs> uh, they, they, uh, I, we all know that. That's a fact set in mm-hmm. stone. I wanted to know how better they are, yeah. in fact. Yeah. So I looked it up. A dog's sense of smell is approximately 10,000 to 100,000 100, times stronger than a human's. That that's a, crazy. That's a good sniffer. Though I would argue that Jordan Bud has a better nose <laughs> than a dog. Maybe Why like do you a, say that? <laughs> the First man, of all. the man smells everything. Really? Yes. He'll like come up to me and be like, "This like just gave me a good scent." And I was like, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> so well, Jordan and dogs are in the same level, is what you're saying? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And, and I want to I want to conceptualize this real quick. Okay. Uh, th- this is as if you're trying to sniff out one teaspoon of sugar mm-hmm. that is in two Olympic sized swimming pools. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. That's powerful. Yeah. See. I personally have the worst sense of smell ever, and I can't ever smell anything. Even, like, pre-pandemic, like, never had a good sense of smell. Nope. My nose is always clogged up. <laughs> uh, there's no smells getting through there. <laughs> I have a I have a pretty okay sniffer. Yeah? If I do say Your so myself. Your sniffer's okay? Average sniffer. sniffer. Pretty average sniffer. You're an average sniffer? Yeah. yeah. That's pretty cool. Nice. That's a good dog fact. Is it? Did you confirm it on Snopes or no? I actually got it from Stubbs. Did you really? Mm-hmm. Okay, <laughs> that's good. See, at least we have one good, one good person in the in the show. Hey, hey. Alex, what's your fact? Well, my fact's from the American Kennel Club, which is like not the Snopes, sn- but not dog Snopes. Snopes. Yeah, dog Snopes. Dog, dog Snopes. Snopes. Dog Snopes. Mm-hmm. So, uh, the dog fact that I have for you today is that yawning is contagious, even for dogs. And that research shows that the sound of a human yawn can trigger one from your dog. And fun fact, it is four times as likely to happen when it's the yawn of a person your dog knows. Hmm. That's so cute. So when my dog, I have a dog, by the way, Mm -hmm. whenever she yawns, she makes like a really high pitched noise and she'll go like every time. (laughs) (laughs) Like, Does anyone have a similar experience? I'm just wondering, has your dogs ever done that? I mean, they make a high pitched noise. Uh, Have you ever, like, heard of a dog doing that, I guess? My dog goes like, ah. Yeah, yeah, they do it. <laughs> like, they make a little, a little like, dog noise. A little dog yawn. I've yeah. never had a dog, but I did have a bearded dragon once, and he would yawn occasionally, but he didn't make any noise. He, he, would, just, he would just, like, open his mouth <laughs> for a little bit and then close it. He can be an honorary dog. Yeah. Honorary dog. His name was Captain Jack. He Captain Jack was a D-A-W-G, I yeah. bet. What's okay. your fact, Chloe? Are you, no, I was. <laughs> <laughs> I was. Gonna, I was gonna go. Are you guys ready for my fact? And then you interrupted me. Yep. Because I knew you were about to say it. Have you ever heard of the Beatles? <laughs> nope. Before is you that, know, like is the that band? An underground band. They're yeah, they're kind of like they're nobody indie. really they're knows local. them. Yeah, they're local. Yeah. But they did have one song called "A Day in the Life." That's you know that's probably their most popular song. I would say. Mm-hmm. No, I'm just I kidding. don't know, man. I'd say Yellow Submarine. No. How'd Sergeant you know that song? Pepper's Lonely Hearts. Yeah. 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 The whole album. Yeah, the whole album. Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, so the Beatles song, A Day in the Life, which I'm sure you've heard of. You would know it if you heard it if you don't know it by title. Sure. But it has a frequency in it that only your dogs can hear. Back in 2013, Paul McCartney was in an interview 
And he said that he added a frequency that only dogs can hear at the end of the song. And he said that you should play it and watch your dog, like, react to it. And I think that that's really sweet that he, like, dedicated a little part of the song to dogs. The question is, that's is just it, so like, cool. a good dedication say, or, like, a bad dedication? Is it, like, pleasant to the dog's ears? Yeah, yeah. It's, not like a, it's not like a dog whistle where it's going to, like, hurt the dog, mm-hmm. you know, like, to, like, try to, like, train them or anything. Mm-hmm. No, it's like a... Like a calm tone, from right. my understanding. I don't. I, I'm not like saying he did it Paul's to, like, to get my dog or anything. No, well, no, no. He sure. he did it in like yeah. a dedication, so I can only imagine that it's like pleasant. Did he dedicate pleasant. it to all dogs or one dog in particular? I don't know. Why don't you ask one him? Because one dog can hear dog. this noise. Yeah. Ask him. Call him. Hey Paul, did you dedicate hey, Paul. this dog? <laughs> <laughs> what dog? Uh, good old. Uh, what, what's her name? L- Lila, Layla, Laika. 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 That is that. This is post Laika. Post Laika, exactly. Dedicated to Laika. In maybe, remembrance. maybe. Yeah, that that's a throwback. Throwback. That's Shout a, out to just the facts. Shout out just the facts episode space. <laughs> yeah, whenever that was, space. I can't remember. Not too long ago, earlier this semester. No, it was last semester. Oh, you can find that on our YouTube. Yeah, yeah check yeah, out our yeah, YouTube. Check page. out our YouTube. Oh, jinx. Knock on wood. <laughs> There's no wood. <laughs> Alex just went into a full panic. <laughs> there was no. I was gonna knock on like the thing, but it, I don't think it's wood. I, I think, think it's plastic. I think it. I think it's like yeah. MDF. Well, thank you guys for bringing your dog facts. Sure. I like You're hearing welcome. them. We should nice. bring our dogs next. Yeah, we should. Everybody brings in a. Pet. Oh, the window frames wood. I hope that there was go. picked up. I'm sure it was. <laughs> I can win. Nice. Anyways, thank you guys for tuning into this week's episode of Just Facts. We'll see you same time, same place next week. Thank you for Hunter and Alex for bringing the dog facts. You're welcome. Glad I could <laughs> find this factory. <laughs> <laughs> I, really I wasn't expecting you to answer, but that was great. <laughs> okay, Alex is having a long week. Dogs. 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 Hey, Hunter, you're a dog. Well, thank you guys for uh, listening. See you next week.